So let me tell you a secret about the Republican Party. If you're a Democrat, you got to make sure you keep it a secret. This is only for Republicans. Most of us don't care if you're gay or not. Just don't push it on our children. Hi, this is Alonzo Bowden with another Rebel HQ TYT video. And uh, hey, don't tell anyone. <laughs> My first concern on this video is the backwards flag behind him. I don't know what message that's sending. But isn't it interesting that he feels in order to be a good Republican, you have to keep it a secret that you don't hate gay people, that you don't hate trans people, that you're okay with people having freedom of religion, that you don't hate immigrants. You got to keep that a secret. What's that? You don't hate gay people properly? Well, you can't be in the Republican Party. I mean, isn't that the message he's sending? You got to keep it a secret. Transgender, we don't like him at all. Of course, the red states download far more transgender porn than the blue states. What's that? Pornhub keeps statistics? Hmm, not sure what we're going to do about that one. Yeah, that is true. They download more trans porn. But, uh, you know, <laughs> don't tell anyone. Got to protect the children. Most of us... Don't care if you're trans. Just don't push them on our children. Most of us don't really care if you go to church or not, or you're an atheist. Just don't push it on our children. He's always worried about them pushing it on the children. You know, I have a gay friend, and he got into it with a straight guy once, and he said something I will never forget. I heard this line almost 20 years ago, and I'll never forget it. He said, hey, we're not recruiting. I mean, push it on the children. How does that work? Do you think there's a gay teacher that closes the door and says, hey kids, today I'm going to teach you how to be gay. Do you think there's a transgender teacher saying, hey kids, today I'm going to teach you how to transition? No, no, there isn't. At worst, at the very worst, you know what they're teaching them? They're teaching them that gay people are human, that trans people are human, and should be treated with the respect of a human being. But don't tell the Republicans that because that would be too nice. As a matter of fact, to treat people with respect as human beings, that might be something Jesus would do. Don't tell anyone, but they're not pushing atheism on your children. They're pushing Christianity on your children. Most of us could care less how many people are immigrants in America. Just do it the right way. Does it surprise you? That's what they don't want you to tell the children, that the United States is a nation of laws and freedom of religion means there is no official religion, not Christianity, which is what they want you to think. Now let's take a moment and talk about immigrants, because he says they don't care about immigrants. Well, why would you care about immigrants? Because back when your grandparents immigrated, they may not have had papers and they probably didn't speak English. They certainly didn't come over here with a full-time job. No, they went to Ellis Island, and Ellis Island let them in and gave them a new name, and they started their lives. It's interesting when you talk about immigrants, and again, don't tell anyone, but you're talking about brown immigrants, aren't you? You're not talking about white immigrants, many of whom come here illegally from Eastern Europe, and now we're dealing with refugees from the Ukraine because of that war, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. No mention of that, and what about those Canadians? Oh yeah, I know them. They've been sneaking over in droves. No, you don't want to talk about immigration. You only want to talk about people who come over here legally. And you only want to talk about people who look like you. What he should say is, don't tell anyone, but I'm lying in this video. Of course you don't like gays. You don't like trans people. You don't like immigrants. Because if you liked them, you wouldn't be able to demonize them. You wouldn't be able to scare the children. Because that's where the dislike and the hate comes from. Fear. You fear these people because they're different. Here's an idea. How about teaching your children that all these people are human and they deserve to be respected and left alone? Yeah, what if you taught your children not just about Christianity and pointing fingers, but about the actual teachings of Jesus? Things like charity. Yeah, what about that? Do unto others as you would have them do unto themselves. You know what Jesus would do for immigrants? He would take them in and he would clothe them and he would feed them. It's in the book. Maybe you should read the Bible rather than just wave it at people. Yeah, Jesus liked healing the sick and he didn't charge them extra money for that. Jesus liked feeding the hungry and he, he had no real problem with poor people. Everybody you can't stand, Jesus loved. Maybe, and don't tell the Republicans this, you should read the Bible and act a little more like Jesus. What would Jesus do? Mm, he would tell somebody.